This is a tape uh, of the Lamana Chai Shemesh shop. Um, and it's just to give you an idea of the work we do here and what we look like. So here we go, we'll go on in. Okay, now as you see the shop is extremely small. We, what we have done is that we put the women tops over here on the right, the women's skirts on the bottom right, the boys, big boys here on the top, to, uh, tops and on the bottom bottoms, but as you can see there were very few bottoms, so we put tops on the bottom as well. Um, we try to change the shop around, you know, pertaining to the season. Hello. For example, now in the winter we have coats. And uh, here we have Julie Morris. Hi. Um, one of the women that runs the shop. And one moment, we'll keep going in a second. This shop, even though it's so small and cramped, on a sale day, we sell a thousand items in two hours. That's the popularity of the store. It's a real gold mine. As you see, we try to give a very good service to the community that they cannot find in other places. Um, and it's a very big contribution. We also have, this is our men's section, uh, men's coats and jackets, men's tops and bottoms. Um, and as you, we have uh, certain items, for example, uh, okay, some items we don't have room for to hang up and we're not as organized as we wish we could be. Um, so we have some items, uh, especially seasonal ones, in baskets, like bathing suits, which we do not have out at the moment. But we have pajamas. All right, et cetera. As you see, we try to make very good use with whatever we're given. Um, everything gets either sold at the shop. This is our um, do suggested donation list um, with the prices. And anything that does not get sold goes to the Ethiopian Gmach and other... Okay, anything that doesn't get sold, it gets donated to one of the uh, gmachim that serves the needy community um, of the Ethiopians and uh, other sects in the Beit Shemesh area that are more needy. Um, as you see, this is our storage room with the boxes. We try to keep it neat. Uh, well, we work very hard, but as you see, uh, it definitely gets a little out of hand sometimes. Because it's also a changing room. It also happens to be our changing room. Uh, because this is basically the entire shop, what you've just seen. We have about, what would you say, Julie? 40 square meters? Maybe. Maximum. Maximum. Approximately 40 square meters, which is? This out. It's about 400 square feet, 350 square feet. I don't know. But it's very cramped. Um, we're working on it and we do the best Very we can. Cramped. This is Ayelet, the manager of the Shemesh shop. Um, okay, my name is Ayelet Wagshal and I'm the one that's uh, running the shop at the moment. I've been here for about two years. Um, I came a little bit after they, uh, Esther Schwartz and uh, Sharon Shamroth started the project. And I'm trying to work with, uh, uh, within the constraints of what we have in order to better uh, the community service that we give. So um, basically, we see the Shemesh shop as an opportunity to provide a great shopping experience for everyone in the community, regardless of their budget um, issues, whether uh, it's uh, th we have some customers that come in that could definitely afford to buy brand new items, but prefer to uh, to donate uh, their time, uh, their money, basically to uh, the Shemesh shop, and because all proceeds uh, go to Laman Chai uh, to further the the needy of the community as well. Um, also, the fact that. People that are middle class and uh, represent the entire community come to the shop 
what it does is it allows people that are from poor financial capabilities to come and shop without feeling um, embarrassed. So what you'll find at any given moment in the shop when it's open is a wide mix of people from all different um, backgrounds and capabilities. But generally what they're all happy is with um, the clothing scent. They all enjoy it and it gives them all um, a great service. Uh, fine at any given moment in the shop when it's open is a wide mix of people from all different um, backgrounds and capabilities. But generally what they're all happy is with um, the clothing that's sent. They all enjoy it and it gives them all um, a great service. Um, yeah. So uh, we, we, we thank you very much to Yad Lea for all uh, that they provide to us. Um, and Jessica Katz and Karen Thaler for all the time and effort that they put into the project. Um, and if you want to see we are, and, look at the Lemanachai website. See we right, and you can yes. go to uh, www.lemanachai, L A M A A L E M A A N. Sorry again. Www. L E L E M. Savage. Is the girls section, the tops, and the bottoms, and we go into baby, baby boys, and baby girls. So as you see, in a small little shop, we found a place for everybody and and to um, and for most of the items uh, that were sent. Um, and that's it, so thank you very much. Thank you very much, you do a great job. Bye-bye.